The Vatican Museums Italian, Musei Vaticani, Latin, Musea Vaticana are Christian and art museums located within the city boundaries of the Vatican City. They display works from the immense collection amassed by popes throughout the centuries including several of the most renowned Roman sculptures and most important masterpieces of Renaissance art in the world. The museums contain roughly 70,000 works, of which 20,000 are on display, and currently employ 640 people who work in 40 different administrative, scholarly, and restoration departments. Pope Julius II founded the museums in the early 16th century. The Sistine Chapel, with its ceiling decorated by Michelangelo and the Stans di Raffaello decorated by Raphael, are on the visitor route through the Vatican Museums. In 2017, they were visited by 6 million people, which combined makes it the fifth most visited art museum in the world. There are 54 galleries, or sale, in total, with the Sistine Chapel, notably, being the very last sala within the museum. It is one of the largest museums in the world. In 2017, the museum's official website and social media presence was completely redone, in accord with current standards and appearances for modern websites. History The Vatican museums trace their origin to one marble sculpture, purchased in the 16th century. Laocoon and his sons was discovered on 14 January 1506, in a vineyard near the Basilica of Santa Maria Maggiore in Rome. Pope Julius II sent Giuliano da Sangallo and Michelangelo Buonarroti, who were working at the Vatican, to examine the discovery. On their recommendation, the Pope immediately purchased the sculpture from the vineyard owner. The Pope put the sculpture, which depicts the Trojan priest Laocoon and his two sons being attacked by giant serpents, on public display at the Vatican exactly one month after its discovery. Benedict XIV founded the Museum Christianum, and some of the Vatican collections formed the Lateran Museum, which Pius IX founded by decree in 1854. The museums celebrated their 500th anniversary in October 2006 by permanently opening the excavations of a Vatican Hill necropolis to the public. On 1 January 2017, Barbara Giotta became the director of the Vatican Museums, replacing Antonio Paolucci, who had been director since 2007. Pinacoteca Vaticana The art gallery was housed in the Borgia apartment until Pope Pius XI ordered construction of a proper building. The new building, designed by Luca Beltrami, was inaugurated on 27 October 1932. The museum has paintings including Giotto's Stefaneschi Triptych, Olivuccio di Cicarello, Opere di Misericordia. Raphael's Madonna of Foligno, Adi Altarpiece and Transfiguration Leonardo da Vinci Street Jerome in the Wilderness Caravaggio's Entombment Perugino's Madonna and Child with Saints and San Francesco al Prato Resurrection Filippo Lippi's Marsipini Coronation Gian Matteco's Sobieski at Vienna Topic. Collection of modern religious art The collection of modern religious art was added in 1973 and houses paintings and sculptures from artists like Carlo Cara, Giorgio de Chirico, Vincent van Gogh, Paul Gauguin, Marc Chagall, Paul Clay, Salvador Dali, and Pablo Picasso. Sculpture museums the group of museums includes several sculpture museums surrounding the Cortile del Belvedere. These are the Gregoriano Profano Museum, with classical sculpture, and others as below. <laughs> Museo Pio Clementino the museum takes its name from two popes, Clement XIV, who established the museum, and Pius VI, the pope who brought the museum to completion. Clement XIV came up with the idea of creating a new museum in Innocent VIII's Belvedere Palace and started the refurbishment work. Pope Clement XIV founded the Pio Clementino Museum in 1771, and originally it contained the Renaissance and antique works. The museum and collection were enlarged by Clement's successor Pius VI. Today, the museum houses works of Greek and Roman sculpture. Some notable galleries are 
Greek cross gallery, Sala Acroce Greca, with the Porphyry sarcophagi of Constance and St. Helen, daughter and mother of Constantine the Great. Sala Rotunda, shaped like a miniature pantheon, the room has impressive ancient mosaics on the floors, and ancient statues lining the perimeter, including a gilded bronze statue of Hercules. Gallery of the Statues Galleria della Statue, as its name implies, holds various important statues, including Sleeping Ariadne and the bust of Menander. It also contains the Barberini Candelabra. Gallery of the Busts Galleria dei Busti, many ancient busts are displayed. Cabinet of the Masks Gabinetto della Machere, the name comes from the mosaic on the floor of the gallery, found in Villa Adriana, which shows ancient theatre masks. Statues are displayed along the walls, including the Three Graces. Sala della Muse, houses the statue group of Apollo and the Nine Muses, uncovered in a Roman villa near Tivoli in 1774, as well as statues by important ancient Greek or Roman sculptors. The centerpiece is the Belvedere Torso, revered by Michelangelo and other Renaissance men. Sala degli Animali, so named because of the many ancient statues of animals. Museo Chiaramonti this museum was founded in the early 19th century by Pope Pius VII, whose surname before his election as Pope was Chiaramonti. The museum consists of a large arched gallery in which are exhibited several statues, sarcophagi and friezes. The new wing, Braccio Nuovo, built by Raphael Stern, houses statues including the Augustus of Prima Porta, the Dori Forest, and the River Nile. The Galleria Lapidaria forms part of the Museo Chiaramonti, and contains over 3,000 stone tablets and inscriptions. It is accessible only with special permission, usually for the purpose of academic study. <laughs> <laughs> Museo Gregoriano Etrusco Founded by Pope Gregory XVI in 1836, this museum has eight galleries and houses important Etruscan pieces, coming from archaeological excavations. The pieces include, vases, sarcophagus, bronzes and the Guglielmi collection. Museo Gregoriano Agiziano This museum houses a large collection of artifacts from ancient Egypt. Such material includes papyruses, the grassy collection, animal mummies, and reproductions of the Book of the Dead. History The Museo Gregoriano Agiziano was inaugurated on 2 February 1839 to commemorate the anniversary of Gregory XVI's accession to the papacy. The creation of the Museo Gregoriano Agiziano was particularly close to the Pope's heart as he believed the understanding of ancient Egyptian civilization was vital in terms of its scientific importance as well as its value in understanding the Old Testament. This feeling was expressed in a paper by the museum's first curator, the physiologist and Barnabite, Father Luigi Maria Ungarelli. Vatican Historical Museum The Vatican Historical Museum Italian, Museo Storico Vaticano was founded in 1973 at the behest of Pope Paul VI, and was initially hosted in environments under the Square Garden. In 1987, it moved to the main floor of the Apostolic Palace of the Lateran where it opened in March 1991. The Vatican Historical Museum has a unique collection of portraits of the popes from the 16th century to date, the memorable items of the Papal Military Corps of the 16–17th centuries and old religious paraphernalia related to rituals of the papacy. Also on display on the lower floor are the Papamobili popemobiles, carriages and motorcars of popes and cardinals, including the first cars used by popes. Highlights from the painting collection. Topic. Other highlights in the museum. Topic. The red marble papal throne, formerly in the Basilica di San Giovanni in Laterano. 
Roman sculpture, tombstones, and inscriptions, including the early Christian sarcophagus of Junius Bassus and dogmatic sarcophagus, and the epitaph of Lucius Cornelius Scipio Barbatus. The Raphael rooms with many works by Raphael and his workshop, including the masterpiece The School of Athens. The Nicolene Chapel The Sistine Chapel, including the Sistine Chapel ceiling. The Gallery of Maps, topographical maps of the whole of Italy, painted on the walls by Friar Ignazio Danti of Perugia, commissioned by Pope Gregory XIII It remains the world's largest pictorial geographical study. The frescoes and other works in the Borgia apartment built for Pope Alexander VI Borgia. The Bramante Staircase, is a double spiral staircase designed by Giuseppe Momo in 1932. The staircase has two parts, a double helix, and is of shallow incline, being a stepped ramp rather than a true staircase. It is encircles the outer wall of a stairwell of approximately 15 meters feet wide and with a clear space at the center. The balustrade around the ramp is of ornately worked metal. Visitors. The museums had 6,427,277 visitors in 2017, making them the fourth most visited art museum in the world. See also Academia, Venice Uffizi, Florence Index of Vatican City-related articles List of most visited art museums References Further reading G. Spinola, Il Museo Pio Clementino, 3 vols, 1996, 1999, 2004. G. B. Visconti and E. Q. Visconti, Il Museo Pio Clementino Discreto, 8 vols, 1782 to 1792. Daly, John, 1982. The Vatican: Spirit and Art of Christian Rome. New York: The Metropolitan Museum of Art. ISBN 978-0810917118. Peter Rohrbacher, Volkerkunde und Afrikanistik für den Papst. Missionsexperten und der Vatikan 1922–1939 in, Romisch Historische Mitteilungen 54 2012, 583–610. External links Topic. Official website Vatican Museum's official online ticket office Official English information